Alright, hey guys, it's Shackle here, and I was going to show you guys how to set up your controls and your UI interface and targeting system to play like a first person shooter. Well, you can play like a first person shooter, but I like to play it third person. And this is me, this is my little bug friend. Really cute, yeah. Alright, I'm going to show you what I'm talking about first person shooter. See this rectangle in the middle? The thing that comes up when I hold down right click to move the camera? I have it set up where I don't have to target anything ever. I can just point. See that guy right there? It'll target the nearest one that's near the middle. And I can point this guy over there, point the, even the far guys. And as soon as I get on them, see I'll show you. As soon as I get on them, see? It targets them. So I don't ever have to target anything. Because there's a lot of abilities that won't, you don't have to target somebody. You can hit a lot of people at once. And it's easier to do it like that. Let me show you. These guys won't attack me because I'm a lot higher level. Team target, 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 target. And it, it reacts really fast because the combat in this game is really, really crazy fast. They can run up and just start killing these people. Well, missing. <laughs> I don't ever have to target. I can run around and fight, have one. Because a lot of abilities, too, in this game are movement based. See, I can still move around while fighting. So this really helps. So I can run, hit this guy, hit this guy, hit this guy. And during PvP, this is a must. You have to do this for PvP. Because there's so much going on, and everybody's running around. Everybody has superpowers, and they're really fast. See, I don't ever have to just stop, you know, press tab, you know, and tab cycle through the targets or anything. I don't ever have to target anything. All my abilities will work perfectly fine. Okay. Uh, let's show you with... Well, I'm going over to a better place. Show you some of the... This is what you need to do. Go to options, go to controls, uh, control scheme. You can do shooter or action. I like MMO. Uh, they just do different stuff. It's just how what buttons do what, and it opens up more key bindings, whatever you choose. Uh, I use champions default. You can do first person shooter, and it will be like you hold right click, move left and right. Uh, it's like you're holding right click but you're not it's you I think if you right click you can use your mouse so it's more like a first person shoot that way okay what you want is free camera you want face off screen target on attack uh, you want that off uh, always face forward on mouse look rectangle on camera center out for tab targeting order this is that's the biggie camera center out it doesn't matter you're not going to be using tab targeting but that's what you want uh, reset inactive tab target on. Click unselects target on. You don't remember targeting anyways, but unselect off screen targets off. Uh, auto target priority. This is what you want. You want closest to camera center, not nearest within camera center. That will just auto target the people that are close to you when you point at them. You want closest to camera center. So whenever you point at anybody, that's who you're going to target. Uh, visible auto target auto target on. Uh, that just shows you who you're going to be auto targeting. Uh, only attack if target is selected. You want that off, off, definitely off. That's what makes you you're able to attack without targeting. You can just run around and hit whoever's near you, or if you're ranged, run around and hit and shoot whatever's you're pointing at. Uh, select auto target on attack off. Uh, so you don't target them, so you can just keep going through them. Uh, melee can ignore selected targets. You want that on just so it helps hit people when you're close to them. Assist target on attack. You can assist uh, an enemy or you can assist a friend in attack and you can see who they're, they're attacking. Maximum targeting is this distance zero. Never auto attack objects. You can put that off so you can uh, auto attack objects like cars and stuff like that because there's a lot of quests that uh, you gotta hit those things makes it easier target threatening enemies first you want that off 
so it's more accurate on what you're pointing at so it doesn't mess with you. Select attacker if attacked off. Uh, stop moving when interacting on and auto attack maintain. You might not know what this is but put this on maintain. I'll show you what that is right now. See this down here? This first slot besides your block one, this is your block, your first slot put your energy builder on here and whenever you attack something all you have to do is hold it down. So watch, I'll hold it down now. Okay. I'm holding it down and it's constantly building energy. I don't have to keep pushing it and pushing it and pushing it. I don't have to keep tab uh, hitting it, hitting it. I can hold it down and it'll just go. And when I let go, it stops. Now push it down. Okay. It's really, really simple. Uh, let's see what else I can show you. Those are good guys. <laughs> See, it's really accurate if you have ranged abilities this is a big thing it's ranged and melee it's both good I could never play a game that's not like this anymore I really couldn't uh, so yeah that's it for the well let me show you go to options controls and see the control scheme will open up a lot of different stuff go to shooter controls and first person shooter keybind set. Now my right click is always on. I always have right click. It's always the camera movement. I can hold right click to move my mouse but it's more like a first person shooter because I'll always be pointing where I'm moving. And see this this game is actually a very movement based game. You will always have to be moving. You will always have to be going somewhere or doing something. Especially in the Alright. Uh, thanks for watching.